Today I'm going to teach you four ways to transfer your photos from your phone to your computer. Hey there everyone, my name is Bruno and this is Dr. Phone, the app that does everything you ever wanted on your iPhone in a quick and easy way. Subscribe if you want to check out other tech tutorials and phone reviews. The first method we'll be using is our good old friend, Dr. Phone. If you don't have it yet, the link is down in the description box. So first thing, open up Dr. Phone and let's go to Phone Manager. Now we unlock the phone and connect it to the computer using the USB cable. And Dr. Phone is going to automatically detect your device. Go over here to Photos and Dr. Phone will read your photo library and images will load up on the screen. Now you can select the images you want to download. You can select an individual image or groups of images, as well as have access to your galleries right here on the left side. After you've made your selection, click on Export to Mac or PC, depending on your operating system, and you'll get a Save To dialog box. Select where you want to save and hit Open. Your photos are now being copied to the location you just selected. Pretty easy, huh? Now we're going to use Windows to copy the photos to your computer. Simply plug the phone into your computer's USB port using the lightning cable. And a window should pop up identifying the phone. On your phone, you'll get a message that asks you if you want to allow that computer to access your files. Select Allow. Now on your computer, hit Import Pictures and Videos and you're done. For the third method, we'll be using Google Drive. The truth is you can use any other cloud-based storage system in a very similar way. Google gives you 15 gigs of free space and that should be enough to hold all of your pictures. But even if it isn't, you can just repeat this process and copy the photos in multiple batches. First thing, let's download the Google Drive app from the App Store. Don't worry, it's free. Once it's installed, log in. You probably already have a Google account if you have Gmail or comment on YouTube. If not, just make a new account. So first thing, let's create a new folder to put all your photos in. We don't want to make a big mess here. So hit the big plus sign on the bottom right corner and select folder. Name the folder whatever you want. Now press the plus button again and select upload and then photos and videos. Your photo library will pop up and you can select all the pictures you want to send. Once you're done, click Upload on the upper right corner and wait for them to upload. When this is done, all you have to do is, on your computer, go to drive.google.com, log in and download your pictures. And if you're old school, you can still email yourself a picture. Go to the Photos app on your phone and now click on the Share icon on the bottom left. It looks like a box with an arrow on it. Select Mail. Your phone will open your email software. Now type your email address in and click the send button. Now all you have to do is check your email on your computer. Now that we've seen these four methods, leave in the comments which one you prefer. And see you next time with other tech related tutorials. See ya!